Hello everyone, welcome back to my Unreal Engine Open World tutorial series. So in this episode, I am going to work on this climb up part. This climbing up animation. As always, this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons. Thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me. Alright, so at the moment my character can do this. Oh. Wait. It can hang on the uh, wall. But it has some problems as you can see. Sometimes it uh, goes like this. This is the correct way and sometimes it goes inside the wall so anyway uh, the next step is climbing up the wall the ledge so for that I am going to use this animation Climbing animation from Mixamo and I download this with the Mixamo rig and then using this blender plugin I'm I'm going to add a root bone as I have showed in this uh, Tutorial I'm going to add root more root bone to the blender plugin because uh, I won't I need to have root motion in order to climb move up the character so I have already done that using this plugin this is the plugin and this is uh, blender 2.78 okay and I have converted and imported that animation here so now you can see the root bone is also moving upwards right now uh, let's create a montage let's call it climb up So first, uh, let me drag and drop, uh, drag and drop this animation. I to see how it works. Oh, it's not working. Right. Uh, let's drag and drop this animation instead of the montage. Right. Now as you can see here This character needs to be in a place like this To properly work this animation And if I play the animation manually you can see character climbing up and move there Okay, so how do we properly play this animation with the root motion in the game in the runtime? First, uh, yeah, let me go to the zero position. Uh, I, I want to see how does this is there any differences in between this animations starting hand location and the next and the idle climbing animations that means this one hand locations so if i put it like this oh there is a difference uh, let's compare these animations in the animation view let's go to the front view okay it's like this and let's see the climbing animation. 
looks like this okay how do we fix this right so if we if we set this point as the hands point then let's all right uh, let's move this animation like this Add a key and apply. Now both animations have the same location. See? All right. Now let's see here. let me check again okay same spot and same spot right now here if I put the climb in let's climb in oh there is still a difference why is that? I delete this. Well, I deleted that and added it again. Now it's working fine. Like this. Alright. Now let's keep this only for reference. Okay. Uh, now let me again enable the capsule visibility it's because I need to see the location of my character related to the capsule okay I guess this is not good because my character is way off from the capsule location I'm not sure if that will work okay anyway let's try this uh, after hanging on ledge let's automatically move character upwards like this play any montage and for the montage let's use this uh, climb up for this we need to use root motion and root motion root lock animation first frame all right now let's see what happens Um, okay I think this is what happened mm. I asked this uh, once this uh, montage is uh, play stopped we should turn back characters walking so let's add a delay of what's the length of this animation 3.83 okay 
let's say this is only for testing we need to replace this with the proper mechanism so let's this is only for testing see what happens all right so that's what happened but uh, that's not going to work but to see this properly uh, let's slow down the time here set time global time dilation to 0.1 so we can clearly inspect what's happening okay the initial location is wrong but uh, the capsule is moving with the character a good thing but the capsule is still out all right so at this point okay so by the time the character reach the top the character's foot location should be in the root now that's a problem so to fix this first uh, the hanging idle is in this position and the climbing animation uh, starts in this position so to fix this uh, let's first do this let's start the hang this climbing animation in this position because that's the closest pose to the idle animation on the wall so let me duplicate this one let's call it climb up anim because I need to preserve the original animation also so let's start it here what's the point ah. remove from 0 to 36 okay now let's uh, open the hanging idle it's here I think in this position the character's root no character's root should be near the foot but how to fix that mm. what if I move the character from the hip like this and add a key and apply Will that work? I don't know. Then let's move the road here. Add a key and apply. Oh, what happened there? Mm, I'm not sure. Oh, let me undo this all. first uh, 
Rainbow Road Motion. And uh, let's restart the process. Now, can I move this from the root itself? Oh no, that's not. Let's move it from the hip. Well, actually, I have <laughs> no idea how this works. Yeah, first I must confess that I am trying to do something like trial and error method here because I am not sure, to, not sure, too sure how to edit the animation. So I am going to figure out what to do here. So when I, after doing that, it seems my hips are right like this, but root is kind of going root is wrong actually now at the ending position the character should be here uh, but I'm not sure how to fix it where's the root okay there can I add something like a guide reference uh, point no I can't Can I show the... Show all bones. No. Let's keep this 4 as a reference. This number 4. So my characters foot level should be here oh no I can't move them wait did I move it in any wrong way oh no luckily oh I changed the zoom level so I think I have to re check it Now oh, where's the root? Right here. Right here. At the 7. And I should move my character's foot location. There. Add a key, apply. Okay, now let's see how the route works. There are some problems, but because the hand should be in the same position. And at this point, root is above. But anyway, let's for the climb up. Let's use 
the climb up animation and see what happens okay now the character starts to low right so we need to fix that the starting position so to fix that let's disconnect this part for now well no actually the, the whole part and uh, then uh, we need to match this uh, free hanging idle animation not that this one this one with the climb up animations starting point so climb up animation starts like this and location is here in the characters bottom right in the hanging idle it's like that so let's let's move it down here now let's see foot here and uh, right but the hands are a little bit forward but I guess that wouldn't be a big issue now let's try to match this okay now as you can see i should move my character upwards so we need to modify this value instead of 130 let's try 90 not enough Okay, I guess 50 is minus 50 is okay. Right, the vertical uh, location is alright, but character should move forward a little bit. But uh, we need to fix that with the animation. So now let's first uh, reconnect the flow. Yeah, uh, maybe before uh, starting the next animation, let's give some time for the character to settle and we can observe it properly like two seconds. Now it starts climbing. Oh, did we enable the road motion all right we didn't enable the road motion right oh what happened there This is wrong.
didn't I re-enabled working? Okay, I did. Now the new animation's length is 2.67. So we need to fix it in not here. In here two point what's the length two point six seven Okay, now actually it does climb up, but the problem is it doesn't look perfect, the action. So let's see how it would look if I skip this slowing down part. Still need to fix this. First, I'll reduce this to 2.5 and see how it looks. Okay, so the main thing I should fix is this. I need this. Otherwise, I can't see it properly. At some time, my character is like, first we need to move the character closer to the... Okay, first, fix the first problem. That means this hanging idle. It should be moved forward a little bit to properly touch the wall not yet Row. okay that's good enough right now let's work on the climb up animation okay I am starting to modify this animation by keeping the root motion enabled just like before I'm moving the root a little bit and add a keyframe, move a little bit and add a keyframe. So that's what I'm going to do. But maybe, um, because of the collision of the capsule component, uh, my root motion is not working properly. So, here, let's uh, temp uh, just for the testing. Let's uh, set disable collisions and see what happens. All right, there is an issue. 
okay so I need to recalculate this moment location maybe instead of 180 oh wait no not that uh, get this uh, impact normal normal of the heat in world space normal of the heat in world let's get this and multiply by what's the radius of this capsule 60 60 units and then add to this target location let's see oh 60 is too much let's try 40 yeah 40 seems all right Does the character go properly? Still, the foot location is wrong, so it should be lower. But other than that, it's all right. Yeah. So I have. So this is the final foot location. I think I should move it down a little bit. Fly. Let's see. A starting point is wrong. Other than that, it's pretty much all right. yeah now you may notice that uh, there is a mismatch here and the first frame of the climbing animation so maybe that's because there is a mismatch in this one and the climb up animation let's see if I disable root motion okay it's like this now I'll put this code like me sign here as a reference and then I'll switch to hanging idle that's not much of a there is not much of a difference actually so let's enable root motion for this animation too so maybe we can we might be able to notice a difference well I'm not sure anyway there is another problem in the climb up 
and that is uh, let me disable root motion for now here you can see uh, this hand position should be static but it push back and forward so let's keep this as a reference Now here, I think we should move the character like this. Let's put this sign here and, uh, and to point the by the fingers. Now at this position, this should be here. So So dot to some extent, I'm not sure. Let's see. Okay, much better. Well, now let's uh, skip this time dilation part and see how this looks. These are assets I just placed to test the animations. Oh. That was too fast. I think I changed some. Oh, blend out. I made this 0.25. What if I make this 0.1? Right, I guess it looks fine now. There are minor problems in the animation, but other than that, it's fine. So, I think I can stop this episode at this point. It has already taken about 40 minutes. And after I move here, I should set ready. Wait. Yeah, should I do that? Oh, almost forgot. I need to re enable collisions. Collision enables Korean physics. Right. Uh, now I I need to work on this uh, hanging on the wall part because uh, it's just 
moves they are like a robot but i will fix it in another episode see it's like a robot almost like a robot there is no jumping oh maybe let's just do that here like where yeah. Jump. Oh, not that. What about jump one? Oh, that's also not. I only need the first part. Maybe I should use some animation like this, but I won't do that in this episode. So instead, uh, let's instead of having point two, let's uh, give it some speed based on the distance we have to go. Like uh, get at. Uh, Divide this by let's try five thousand and let's disable this animation for now. Wait, what happened there? What's wrong? Well, I'm going to try 2000. And let's try this for one last time. Okay. Right. So I'm going to stop at this point. Okay. So if you like to support my work, you can get the membership of my Patreon club. The link would be in the description below. And thanks for watching. I'll do a project priority soon regarding this topic. Uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.